Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for December for the sign of Scorpio. This could resonate at any time in December, okay? So keep that in mind. It may not resonate the day you watch it. It may, it may not. We're just going to see what comes up. This reading may or may not be for you. That's basically what I'm saying as well. Let's see. What do we have for Scorpio? I want to thank you for your patience. Um, I don't have any type of schedule. I do these readings when I can. So thank you for not um, hounding me. You guys didn't hound me at all. So I really, really, really appreciate that. What do we have for Scorpio, dear God? Angels, spirits, and universe. I don't know which way I should take that card. King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Now, this is a professional. This is a this is uh, somebody who is very professional. This could be a lawyer. Somebody may be getting a lawyer. This may be somebody that is very... This is definitely somebody who is very authentic to the point, matter of fact. So there's some sort of... Uh, now this is intelligence as well. I just I just heard intelligence. Somebody here is very very intelligent. This person is assertive, um, calculating. We need to get some more cards to see what this is. But you could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius who is very intense. This person is intense, um, very smart, very 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 smart. Um, hmm. Ooh, there is a loss here. I mean, the, the the Ace of Pentacles reverse, that's a loss. Now, this could be somebody that makes a judgment call. So this could even be a judge or a lawyer or a police officer or something. So this is making a decision and sticking to it. Somebody is making a decision. They could be taking something away. Okay. I don't know what that is. It could be you. I don't know. You could be dealing with this person. This person could be feeling a loss of some sort. This person is, whatever decision they're making, it's not being made based on feeling. It's being made based on facts. So this is a loss. It could be a loss of something financial, a financial loss, but it doesn't have to be financial. It could be a loss of stability, a loss of security. Um, something you were hanging on to is being taken away or there's a loss or you could be experiencing something that costs you money. It could be a, yeah, it's like a financial loss by the looks of, this is getting caught. Somebody's getting caught. Okay. The seven of swords reversed. So this is be careful as well. You, I mean, you, maybe for some of you, because this could be you, but this could be somebody else, um, this person could have some tricks up their sleeve and you need to be really careful. This person is very smart, very calculating. They, uh, this person is an investigator of some sort so they can get, they may think that they're getting away with something, but you definitely need to be careful about who you're dealing with. You could be dealing with somebody that is too smart for their own good. Just be really, really careful. Um, hmm. Well, we def we may have a competition here. There could be some sort of con. They may think that another person is stupid. Okay, they may think that another person isn't very wise. But I think they got another thing coming. Um, you definitely are probably dealing with a an air sign, a Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius, or somebody that has a lot of air in their in their chart. This is somebody who is very, very, very calculating as well. And this person, it can be bitter. There's secrets. There definitely is some secrets here. There's stuff that you don't know. There's so, not all is not as it seems. Oh, seriously. Somebody may be... Uh, I mean, this is a card of fantasy, illusion, deception, something. I mean, the, the moon is ruled by the shadow. So it's like the shadow is hiding some. There's somebody that is hiding, and this is hiding as well. 
okay so if you see that that that's hiding somebody is hiding something so you really got to be careful somebody is dealing with a real trickster here and these readings can definitely go by vice versa there's gonna be a big loss be because they're gonna somebody's lies are gonna be revealed and it's gonna cause a big loss or some sort of deception is gonna be revealed this person doesn't care and neither of these people do okay it's not about feelings it's about facts the queen of swords in reverse can be very vindictive very vindictive so what is this queen of swords in reverse very self-sufficient wants to hold on to stability this is what we do have a hard worker here that may be pissed off this is a bitch okay so this person could be pissed off wanting to hold on to something this person is is smarter than you think somebody may think that they can they have somebody wrapped right around their little finger they're hiding something but they're not this person has worked really hard to bring themselves abundance to pick themselves up they're not uh, somebody to mess with okay with the queen of swords reversed Somebody is definitely hiding the truth, avoiding the truth, living in fantasy, living in denial, not wanting to see the truth, not wanting to believe the truth. But this Nine of Pentacles, this is somebody that is very hardworking. Very comfortable with who they are. But this this moon is not as all as it seems. They, I feel like we have somebody here that thinks that they're a lot smarter. They think that they're smarter than this person. But this person has a lot of life experience. I just feel like this person has a lot of life experience. They may think that they that this other person is stupid, but they're not. This two of swords. This is this is. Uh, a, a decision that needs to be made. Somebody has been refusing to see the truth, unable to see the truth, blocking themselves, blocking the truth, seriously, about, it's almost like a fantasy. Somebody may be living in some sort of fantasy land. Not putting in effort, eight of pentacles, not working hard enough. Somebody could be losing a job or losing money. Seriously, this is at work, but not working hard enough. And this could be the boss that sees it. Okay, we could see somebody that's not working hard enough and they're being watched because these people watch. They're being watched. Somebody may be going their own way and, and, and they probably have the ability to go their own way. They're very capable of success, but they're not putting in effort. So it feels like we have somebody that may be losing their job or losing something very significant. They have the capability, but they're not doing it. It's like they're not. Maybe they have some addictions that are getting in the way of their success. This is pretending, pretending to be stable. This is pretending, and this is a lie. So, somebody is pretending to be stable, and they're not. All is not as it seems, okay? So you may be dealing with somebody, or this can go vice versa. Somebody is pretending they're stable. They really are not stable. Ooh, seven of Pentacles reversed. Definitely not stable. This is unrealistic. Some There's going to be a loss of abundance. There's no growth here. There's no future. It's time to go someplace else. Somebody is losing their job. I don't know who it is. It's not going to be everybody, obviously. It doesn't have to be a job, but it has to do with money. There's going to be a loss of money here. This Nine of Pentacles, though, this is stability, but this it's fake. It's fake. With the Moon and the Two of Swords, it's not real. So somebody may think that they're stable and they've got something wrapped and they don't. They could You could have somebody around you that really doesn't like you and they're against you and you don't see it. Just be careful. They may be communicating with the boss or the higher up say, trying to get rid of a person. Just be really careful here. Definitely be careful. That is the meaning of the Seven of Swords reversed. There's going to be financial loss in some arena of your life. You could be dealing with somebody who is very shady. They're jealous, perhaps. 
Whoo! I think it is a female. It is a female that is selfish. Definitely jealous. Definitely, definitely, definitely jealous. Um, ungrounded. Can't take care of themselves. Doesn't want to lose their stability. So just be careful. Somebody is you is dealing with a feminine that is bitter, is resentful, is hateful, is jealous, and uh, it's like this person is trying to hold on to their stability and bring another person down in the meantime so that they don't lose their stability. So just be careful. Be really, really careful. There's a feminine here that is against. I think it's against you. Um. Very selfish individual. You're dealing with a selfish person. There could also be a loss here for some of you. Not everybody, but this is like a loss of a child for somebody. I, I'm sorry to say that, but it is. This cursed person could be bitter, goes all the way back to their childhood. That's why they're so bitter. Um, maybe they have to heal their inner child. Anyhow, um... Now, this is a loss of abundance. This person isn't very caring, isn't very kind, but they may pretend to be. It's all fake. Be careful. Somebody's dealing with somebody that is fake as plastic. Fake, 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 fake. Okay, so be really, really careful, Scorpio. I feel as though uh, there's going to be a relocation. There is. Somebody's not working hard enough, or they're not putting in enough effort, or they're saying that. Um... This is going through a new door. The moment of decision. A decision is going to be made that opens up a new path. Opens up a new doorway. Um, there's definitely going to be a, a decision. This is a decision. This is a decision. A choice that is made between two. There's no growth here. Somebody's going to need to find their strength to restrain themselves and act with, with tact and act with grace. You could be dealing with a Leo. We could have somebody here that has a lot of pride. This person has a lot of pride. A lot of ego. This person is influencing the decision or they're part of the decision. Could have a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn here. Doesn't have to be. We have somebody here that is definitely not stable and they're jealous as hell. There's jealousy issues. And I feel like these jealousy issues are going to come to a head. There's definitely going to be a huge loss. There is. This is a loss. This is a loss. This is a loss. And it's a loss of something that was, it's either a financial loss or it's a loss of stability. Okay, uh, it could be internal stability, it could be insecurities. So there's a lack of value here. Somebody is not being valued or they're just not valuable. It's like this isn't, there's no value in this. There's no value here. There's nothing to hold on to. There's no substance. I really feel as though somebody is going to experience a financial loss because there's a lack of, somebody's not working hard enough. They're not putting in effort. And if it's not financial, it could be a partnership, but I'm not sure. I don't, I'm not sure that this is relationship related. It's obviously that we have relationships with everybody, but all is not as it seems. It's, somebody is not seeing a situation clearly with that moon card in, diver, in reversed. They got somebody that is very, very jealous of them, and there's there this per, and it could be the Leo. I don't know who it is. It it could be the the Earth sign. Could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, whoever it is. This person is selfish, greedy. Um, is trying to hold on to their own stability and it's like they gotta get this other person out of the way. You know, they gotta they gotta do whatever they gotta do and they don't care what they do. They will lie, they will do whatever they gotta do to get this person out of the picture. So they will scheme and they will uh make things up and whatever. So it's like they're they're scheming, they're doing things behind the scenes to cause chaos. So just be prepared. Get be, be prepared. You're dealing with... It's almost like you're dealing with a snake who is out for themselves. 
And somehow it's like, I don't know why they are doing this. Why are they doing this? I think it's because they want to hold on. Woo! Oh my God. So they, they, they want to hold on to a false sense of security. There's going to be a change and this is a major change. Okay. There's going to be a disruption and it's going to be permanent. This is permanent loss. So you're going to go through some sort of permanent uh, change in your life that is going to change things drastically. Some of you are going to be relocating. Either you're going to be re relocating jobs or you're going to be changing homes. This is, this is a shock. This is a shock. And it is a necessary evil. Okay? Light is going to be shed on a situation with somebody that you are dealing with that is going to cause an uproar within some sort of foundation that you are part of. This false foundation is about to crumble and it is going to change your life. Okay? I'm sorry that this is not a beautiful reading, but this is reality. Be careful. Be really, really careful. Watch your back. Okay? Because you got somebody here that doesn't like you and they want to uh, cause disruption in your life. And they're going to do whatever they have to do to make sure that they disrupt your abundance or disrupt your happiness. Okay? So just be careful. There's going to be a major disruption this month and it's going to cause upheaval in your life. It is. And I'm sorry that I can't pretty this up. I guess the only way that I could would be to let you know that you have the strength. You have the skills within you to master your emotions and persevere through this situation. This tells me that you're going to need to have strength and you do have it in you. You do. I feel like you're going to be going through a new doorway that you did not expect to go through. I think that there's going to be a cut. There's going to be a painful decision that is made, whether it's made by you or somebody that isn't you, okay? This is a universal change that is going to force you to take that mask off and open your eyes and see whoever this person is for who they exactly really are. Um, you're going to be uh, going down a new path, whether you like it or not, okay? Because whatever this false foundation is, is about to be uh, shook up, okay? And I don't mean just shook up. It's going to crumble. It's going to be, it's going to be no more. It's, it's over. This is a permanent clean out, okay? It's a per, it is, it's permanent. It's a permanent loss. I'm sorry, but this, this change, this life change, okay, somebody hasn't been in a state of growth with the Empress reverse. They haven't been growing. There's been no nurturing. There's been no love. There's been a lack of value. Somebody may have not known their value. Maybe, maybe they didn't know their worth. And maybe it's time they find out. And because maybe, you know, some people will stay in false senses of security because they don't want to accept change. Twos are cards of change. Fear of change. Anyhow, there's going to be a change. And I think it's going to be emotional. And I think that, uh, and I say it's going to be emotional because we got you here on the bottom, right? This is emotional. This is going to allow you to uh, get the love that you deserve. Okay? Whether it's at, at work or at home. Okay? I feel as though there's going to be a tough decision that is made that, that the universe is in charge of. The universe is in charge here. The universe is going to bring about some sort of loss that changes your path. It changes your direction. And you're going to need to find the strength to persevere. I think there's going to be a relocation, whether it's at work or it's at home. So Scorpio, be prepared, get prepared, and watch your back. you got somebody who doesn't like you, and they, it's like they want to hurt you. You know what I mean? And I don't mean hurt in a physical way. It's in a mental way. They want to put their pain onto you. They want to make you feel the pain that they have felt. And I honestly don't feel like it's, I don't know if it's anything that you did, but there's, there's a, there's a, whoever you're dealing with is emotionless. They're emotionless. I see you relocating in the very near future. 
because shit is about to get real fast. Good luck.